Welcome back to my channel. Today we are talking about the Buetti Power EV3A and charging it from a Renergy 100 watt flexible solar panel. This specific solar panel has more bus bars than a normal panel, making it more efficient in less than ideal conditions, and it's flexible. But we'll be using Buetti EV3A solar power station today to test this panel as the front panel shows us the wattage input and it's small and light to move around. The Blue Edge's number 4 DC input port is what will be used for solar charging. This DC port is 12 to 28 VDC and 8.5 amps max. The VDC of 12 to 20 is important as a solar panel as it exposes more to the powerful sun, either from time of day or clouds, will increase its power output. If the solar panel is not providing enough power output, it's not going to charge what is connected to it. Now, I mentioned in a previous episode about the Blue Eddy, the EV3A can use the same charging method solar panels as the AC200 Max, but not the AC200P. I mentioned this as if you were to purchase AC200P, you'll have to spend more money in solar panels to get it to start to charge. This is where the 200P falls behind the 200 Max. So what we basically have, the solar panel here is MC4 connectors, male and female. The Bluetti also came with a solar cable with the plug on one side and MC4 on the other. Simply take these, plug the male into the female, same on the other side. And then the connector goes into this port over here and then it's ready to start loading if you notice right now there's not enough sun on the panel and it's blink blinking input zero watts so we'll get this out in the sun and have it actually drawing in power 11.30 now, full sun. 20 watts, 55%. One hundred and one watts. 79% charged. Ooh. 30%. I mean, 30 watts, 86%. It's about 1 p.m., bright sunshine. Getting 104 watts. <laughs> 95% charged. Well, overall, we went from 16% to 100% in about five and a half hours. Unfortunately, it was only full sun for a little bit during that time frame. Overall, this Renergy panel is fantastic. When there's full sun, it just really charges up that EV3A really quickly. Unfortunately, in Michigan in the wintertime, as you can see in the picture, we don't get full sun much at all. Anyways, thank you for watching. We'll come back with another episode with the top solar panel and then also using AC200 Max.